So you use lactobacillus salivarius in your mouth and you won't ever even have to brush your teeth. Oral probiotics, particularly lactobacillus salivarius, are well known for their numerous health benefits. Dr. Lawrence Royce, an expert in bacterial biology, has spent many years researching the effects of probiotics on human health. During a mission in Chernobyl, Dr. Royce discovered the immense impact that probiotics can have on humans. Following these discoveries, he further explored Lactobacillus salivarius for its remarkable ability to fortify the human immune system, improve oral health, and reduce bad breath and dental issues. His journey and findings are narrated by David Strait. Let's find out. is so easily cured. I was in the intelligence world, and in the intelligence world, they hire the best and the smartest and the brightest in any given field. You take the top bioscience in the world, Dr. Lawrence Royce, man I highly respect. He probably works for the CIA has saved this entire world, and you don't even know it. He was a top bioscientist at the University of Louisville in Kentucky, and when Chernobyl happened, the CIA came to him and said, hey, we need you. You're the best there is. And they signed a contract with him to go run all the doctors and scientists in Russia for 10 years and handle all the problems of Chernobyl. Things he learned over there, he came back here and he bought a college campus and started a company that builds some of the best probiotics in the world. Because Chernobyl had a mushroom cloud about 50 miles wide and 150 miles long. And in that cloud was several villages. And there was an area, they called that the blue area because nobody was getting sick. One thing radiation poisoning does is it reduces your immune system and you can from the common cold. Anything you get, you could from because you have no immune system. The radiation destroys it. So you had people all over here, but nobody there was even getting sick. They set up a laboratory in the middle school. And they started running the villagers in and taking blood, and checking them out, and checking their health out, and testing it. And they had this whole laboratory of microscopes and all kinds of things, whatever they wanted. And come to find out, after being there for a couple of weeks, one day a family walks in and he starts testing the family. And it's like eight generations of family members. He says, well, how old's grandpa? He looks like he's about 80. No, 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 he's not 80. He's 128. Well, his son was 96. And his son was 70. And his son was in his 50s. And his son, you see what I mean? whole generations and they're all healthy and they all look younger than they are and the Russian government doctors had discovered probiotics that would build their immune system to the point where these people were handling anthrax and other things that would everybody and they weren't even getting sick they had immune systems that were off the charts their bodies were young, they were healthy, and they weren't even getting sick. And these probiotics, were they were taking handfuls of them a day. And they were making these people incredibly healthy. So healthy that the radiation poisoning didn't even reduce their immune systems. And he brought that knowledge back with a whole team of Russian and Ukrainian scientists. And he set up a company here just to build pro these probiotics. Probiotics are very important, but there's one problem. Most of us have been eating crap. And we eat crap, and mucus builds up in our intestines. And probiotics don't work. The other problem is, how do you get it through the different pH levels of your body, your digestive system? Stomach's very acidic. you got to get it past the stomach. That's why yogurt, even though it's good for you, very little of the probiotics get past the stomach because they're not encapsulated. They have to be in a specific type of capsule that doesn't dissolve in the stomach. It dissolves a little bit later. That's one of the keys they learned. That's why that particular company's probiotics are different than most companies' probiotics. So they figured out by taking an all natural recipe of various good organic components you add the right probiotics, you use lactobacillus salivarius in your mouth, and you won't ever even have to brush your teeth. 
because the lactobacillus salivarius doesn't f all your probiotics like toothpaste does. Toothpaste is the most poisonous thing you can put in your mouth. A good doctor will tell you the most, the most dangerous aisle in a supermarket is the toothpaste aisle. You want to c your brains? Fluoride. Boy, they used to give kids fluoride tablets to strengthen their teeth. Better their teeth rot out than take fluoride, because that is your brain. Lactobacillus salivarius, this company won't even make because it's so readily produced and so cheap. Open up the tablets, put them on a spoon, put them in your mouth, work it into your gums and teeth with your tongue. It's tasteless. Lactobacillus salivarius.